Hello, welcome to Texture Myth. In this session, we will discuss about another function of TB2SQL, which is max. So, what a max function will return? Like, let's say uh, we have one table. There, we have stored uh, some data into one particular column, and from that particular column, we want to fetch out the maximum value. Okay. So, in that case, you can easily utilize this max function. And this function you can also utilize in your SQLRPG program. So we, we will see like how we can use this function in SQLRPG. Also, we will see like how we can use uh, this function on the normal query. Okay. But before that, firstly, let me show you the actual table data where we are going to use this function. So I will run one query, select start from Shermit1, which is my library name, and table1, which is my table name. So this is the table and here uh, there are multiple columns so for a moment you can uh, assume that uh, this is the column uh, from which we want to fetch the maximum year of service okay Th this is the column for storing the maximum year for the year of service so from this year of service we will find out what is the maximum value for the year of service so to fetch this detail like from here date from looking at the data we can uh, easily ad identify yes 20 is the maximum one but for now we have only this limited data but it could be lacks of data right so in that case this function would be useful so let's see how we are checking this in SQL RPG program so first of all you need to write this uh, line to start uh, to declare the constant so I just specified here SQL state e underscore valid with five times zeros and below to this we are declaring one variable result variable this variable we are going to use to hold the output which we are retrieving from the max function now below to this we are setting the commitment control as star none and these three line is optional like if you are not doing any kind of modification to your table then you can skip these lines and then we have another uh, line where we are utilizing the actual query so just write exec sql select max of year of service okay so what it will do it will calculate the maximum value of year of service and then that value will be stored into this result holds variable and this data is coming from shermit1 slash table1 now look at the below code so what we are doing here we are checking for the SQL state if SQL state equals to underscore SQL state underscore valid then we are going to print the result because this is the it, it this means that the query is executed properly and when uh, the query is not executed properly then it will go for the else block and there what we are doing we are displaying the SQL state with a message query ended with an error and then end if and inlr equals to star on so let's quickly compile this program and see the output so the output it is returning is 20 okay and if you check the data you can see it is correct all right now we'll see another example but this time we are going to use the query directly on the str sql without sql rpg program so let's say we want to fetch the monthly salary maximum monthly salary so i am using this function select or uh, let me show you how we can easily select the column so just write like this select start from share with one slash table one then take f4 select field f4 select the column let's say i want to check for monthly salary and then simply go and write max function so max max parenthesis and closing parenthesis then hit enter so you can see it is returning the maximum value as 7500 which is the maximum value of this entire column okay so yeah you can use it anywhere like any of the column which is uh, which is holding the valid data make sure that uh, the data should be valid right so you can use on monthly salary product sale you can find find out like what is the product maximum product sale customer expenses so these all detail you can easily track with the help of max function i hope this session is clear to all of you in the next session we will discuss another thing so thank you for watching tech share with